Hey guys, it's Katie Forrestal, and we're back at our land today doing a little clearing. This spot right here is probably where the RV is going to go. It's a little bit hilly there, but not very much, so we'll have to come in and scoop it out a little bit and flatten it. But it's a nice big long space for the RV, and straight across from that over the bank is where the house goes. So we'll probably put some arbor varieties in between to kind of break it off. But this will almost be like the backyard, so it just works out really good for the space and um we had to do some clearing there we got some trees to chop down as you can see once we chop that down the rv should fit in there just perfect and then we got this path that brian cleared yesterday coming through Woo! up around to the house brian's over here doing some more clearing and weed eating and i went into the house pad there and uh, cleared out the the new growth that was coming up. A lot of little trees wanting to start and couldn't even see the house pad before but you can see there's a stake right there. The line goes all the way across. It's 25 feet on each side and you get a better view of the house pad. There's about three trees there that need to be chopped down. Unfortunately they're really nice trees. That one right there will be good for the log cabin one behind it is really thick so i don't know if i could maybe save that but we'll see but not too much to chop down um all this right here came from inside of there from all that growth and then we got another pile down there that brian did so it's a lot of work but starting to get cleared out looking at some great trees here to get ready to chop there's a nice one right there waiting for a friend of ours to come by with the chainsaw so we can do some bigger things next so that's where we're at today and we will keep in touch and let you know how things are going. Have a great day.